All right, so this is the back squat. I don't particularly care if you're a high bar or low bar back squatter. It just kind of depends on what sport you're looking for. Um, I usually go somewhere in between, so I'll show you the difference between those real quick. So high bar, you're going to be basically on the tops of your shoulders. What this is going to do is when you're in the bottom position, let me turn. <laughs> when you're in the bottom position, it should allow you to stay up a little better. Low bar is going to be kind of almost on the rear delts on the bottom of your traps. And what that's going to do is technically let you hit a little more weight because it tends to use a little more back coming up, almost like a good morning or a deadlift. But it also hinges you forward a little bit more as well. In either case, our goal is to get down far enough that the crease of your hip is below your knees. So when I'm at the bottom, can you look at my hips with the phone? Good. So the hips are even or at least below, but hopefully at least even with the knees. That's your back squat. You're good, kiddo.